He's worked his guitar magic for legends such as Marilyn Manson, Rob Zombie, and David Lee Roth. Hi, my name is Stephanie, and welcome to WatchMojo.com. And today we're speaking to John Five. Could you please tell me about how you first ventured into music? I think music kind of chose me, really, because at such a young age, at like seven, I was so intrigued with the guitar for some odd reason. I, I never really put it down. And I played so much that when I was growing this, you know, this part of my hand grew. It grew larger than the other part of my hand, so that hand is bigger than this hand because I would stretch my hand so much. It was very strange. What kind of artists were you listening to at that age? I watched a lot of TV like any seven-year-old kid would. You know, I loved the monkeys and I loved the TV show Hee Haw. And, um, and then I got into Kiss and then Van Halen and stuff like that. Who would you say are some of your influences these days? Being influenced and being inspired is so important to me. I look, look everywhere for inspiration. I'm listening to like gypsy style music and Spanish style. It's not very exciting, of course, I know, but I love knowledge and I love learning as much as possible. It keeps me very occupied. It keeps my brain occupied because I don't really do anything else. played with so many different artists, for example Marilyn Manson, Rob Halford, and now Rob Zombie. Could you give us uh, some of the highlights of your career? Maybe my first real professional thing, I was playing with Katie Lang, and our first gig we were doing something called the VH1 Fashion Music Awards, and, and I'll never forget this, the curtain opened, and there was Madonna, Prince, Peter Gabriel, all in the front row and uh, they were all watching us and I was like wow this is really exciting every month every year there's something big that happens and I don't take anything for granted I appreciate everything that's happened because when I was a kid I just wanted to be a session musician and I never really honestly dreamt that anything like this would happen. Yeah. 